Dude, I'm gonna- hold on. I'm gonna play- alright. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna do my Mame cosplay. I'm gonna do a Mame cosplay right now. Except, I'm gonna do it better. We're going jungle. Right? We're picking Serena. We're going jungle. This is our build. Right? This is our build. This is our, our runes. Um, we're we're gonna do a Mame cosplay, but better. Who's Mame? Are they Edamame? No. Mame is a uh, Japanese top laner. He plays on T2. They uh, got fourth place at Worlds. Yo, what's up, Orion? Mommy? No, not mommy. Mommy relies too much on comeback XP because his team won't get dread. True. Oh, I got an ultra gamer on my team. That go crazy. So the thing is, I queue into JP players and their playstyle is as chaotic as T2. Just boss arena, really loving her. Could you explain the items? Oh yeah, so muscle bands for max efficiency when it comes to your passive. Um Attack weight because attack weight is busted, and AO's cookie because I learned that AO's cookie and potion double stacking Serena goes fucking insane. Um, Coding and I spent probably a week trying to test out different builds with double stacking, and this seemed to be the best for Serena. No X attack, Mame is disappointed. Listen, listen. Mame is good, but his build was kind of grief. I'm gonna put the world on AO's cookie attack weight Serena. Because it's just better. Cookie Loki underrated? Oh yeah. After the bunny nerf, it's like Cookie is just super, super insane. Like, super, super good. No weakness policy? No. Weakness policy is not as good on Serena as Cookie. The extra sustain you get from Cookie and Potion make weakness policy just null and void. Like it's not even close. Skullboy, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Uh, now, the problem is we have to stack from jungle. That's the issue. Now, these guys are going for their 9 o'clock crab, so I can just do this for free. Smile. I'll have to give it a try? Yeah, it's super, super good. I have a couple YouTube videos up on the YouTube channel if you guys are interested. Exclamation mark YouTube in the chat. Oh, I'm going home. I'm lucky. Alright, I'm level 6 on first gank. Oh, dude, you see that Hoopa? This Hoopa knows. This Hoopa knows. He went for the point and then he's like, no, Serena's stacking. Alright, I'm leaving. Maybe not. Hey, guys. Hey, guys, I'm max stacks. I'm six stacks on first gank. I'm six stacks on first gank. That goes insane. So nice when your laner knows about stacking? Oh yeah. For sure. I find it so funny. I've spent so long playing Lucario uh, in competitive and Serena's my best character. Come here, gun. What's up, baby? What's good? Oh. Wait, where are you running? Where are you running? Serena, is this game's version of Aatrox? No, no, no. This game's version of Aatrox is a zoom reel. I can go on this guy actually. This guy is. Uh, we don't. I don't want to fight this far up. Grand already popped X attack. He wasted it. Hmm. This guy is. Where did Gren go? Actually. 
Let's go, guys. Oh. Oh, we went to farm results. I'm gonna come back in. Oh. It's okay, look how tanky I am, by the way. Like, th this is the power of the AOS cookie. This is why I run the AOS cookie. Because I'm just so tanky. So unbelievably tanky. I think screen is more like Riven. You sneak in autos between... Yeah, it's pretty much the same sort of playstyle, yeah. There's animation cancels and you're trying to sneak in autos in between your abilities to do maximum damage and get your stacks and everything. Did you lose health at that point, right? I recognize that Gren. King Mufasa? Oh, I'm frozen. There we go. Wait, can we break this real quick? Nice. Let's go. Push it, team. Push it. Wow. Oh. When you're when your solo queue teammates do competitive plays. Uh what? Oh there it is. Here we go. Here we go, baby. What's up? What's up? What's up, baby? There it is. Woo! God damn. Now that's how you play Serena. Oh, I'm sorry, Pain. What's up? Alright, but you don't win this. Uh, my Hoopa doesn't have ults. Boop! Alright, I'm leaving. They got stomped to the core of the map. Yer. I got a sprint bot. Okay, she's stalling for time. Stalling for time. Oh, if you had waited like 0.1 seconds. Unlucky. Oh, the Blissey ultimate coming through! Wait, this guy dies too. You're dead. Let's go. Doesn't matter that we lost the dread. We got EXP back. T Tars think they can 1v1 Serena? Okay, keep in mind that 1v1 was relatively close, even though it was three levels up and I'm fully stacked. Think about that. This guy dead. I can actually ult here. This is ult timing for Serena. But I need to get my ult back now. I need to power farm. Uh, my blue should be spawning within the next like 10 to 20 seconds. So I'm gonna go get this Audino. The crab's there so that the blue will be there soon. Yep. 65% oh we don't actually have top odds ah oh, that's fine uh 80 should we get off these mid caps Serena nerf seems pretty big yeah definitely now the uh Serena note if you're talking about the one on the PTS it's dude dude oh you need ult too yeah that's fair Crustle's back capping. We have Hoopa ults, actually. I trust this Hoopa. I've seen this Hoopa play all game. I trust this guy. Okay, I need to do this to live. The Gren died. The Blissey ult ran out on the T-Tar. So that guy dies now. It's just the Crustle. 
Huge. GG. There it is. The Serena Jungle Tech, baby. The Serena Jungle Tech. Uh, the Serena nerf on the PTS doesn't seem that big, to be honest. People are definitely overreacting. Can you show emblems for Serena? I did. I showed them uh, before the game, but I'll show them once we get out of this real quick. God damn it. Oh, dude, he's like the best Lucario in the fucking world. Casual pop off for the Raiders. True. Let's check the damage numbers. Damn, dude. 16 kills, 87k? That goes insane, dude. That one's gonna go on the YouTube. Hey, if you guys are watching this on YouTube, make sure to like, follow, uh, comment, follow, subscribe. I don't know. I don't know YouTube too much, but uh, make sure to do all that. We kind of went crazy on the jungle, Serena, not gonna lie.